probably the worst time to have a weekly. Can we schedule weeklies, you know, to not be around Bye. this time? Bye, weekly. Bye, weekly, whatever. Bye, weekly. Bye, weekly. How you doing? I'm doing good. All right, so we're going to do the match. Tux versus Hoshi, how you doing? Bye, weekly. <laughs> All right, I don't so we have got Gengar Gengar first round, because obviously everyone's trying to play Gengar for our first match. Um, Hoshi... Has Hoshi played Gengar before? No. Okay. Except versus me. So other than me, am I the only player at this weekly right now that has actually played Gengar? He toyed with it. Okay. So nobody knows what they're doing with Gengar at this point. I got two... I got more than that, and I'm drinking. That doesn't matter. You play better when you're drunk. Exactly. I do play Gengar a lot better when Oh, I did this to Hoshi, and Hoshi's doing it to Tux. Uh, it works. It's smart, though. At least Hoshi understood. Like, Hoshi took that away from your match. He understood this is something that he can do, which is really nice. Also, happy birthday to Hoshi. If it hasn't been mentioned on stream, it, it is hasn't. his birthday today. He is now 22, even though he looks like he's 14. <laughs> He's like 12. But Hoshi, Hoshi's a really, I have actually personally really liked Hoshi as an addition for a scene. Um, I really want to see him grow a little bit more as a player. I feel like he has the potential. He just needs to sit down and listen and play a little bit more. Maybe listen to some of the advice that he's given. But he's doing a really good job here kind of controlling this match against Tux. Like obviously we see he learned from the match with you that he knows what he can do. He can just to fist keep someone. In just fist him. So Hoshi taking game one. So we'll see. We'll see if Hoshi can keep this momentum going. I think Tux is not going to allow him to gentleman to another character. So once you win, you're locked to your character. Unless he gentlemans that shit. But we'll see what Tux decides to say. Maybe he'll keep Hoshi as Gengar. Oh, and he allowed Hoshi to change. So, which is funny because Hoshi didn't allow, because <laughs> Tux didn't allow me to change. I think Hoshi just ignored it. Probably. <laughs> Man, I need this kind of that kind of to talk about me. Well, if you show up, I'll talk about you like that. But right now we've got. Um, I feel like. If Hoshi knows this matchup in any way, he should be able to handle it well, but he's yeah, definitely going to watch out for really heavy hits that. from from Machamp. So generally you want to keep Machamp in field because you out you outpace him. Yeah, and I feel entirely. like... All right, he just hold shield. No, and he doesn't. Hold he, the R or you hold the L. All right, there's a, that was a really good job recognizing that, that he could punch that. Not sure what Tux was doing because he could have easily pressed his own buttons. And I feel like if Tux would have slapped there in midair, he would have been fine and avoided he uh, as well. He could have avoided a Molga. Easily. But we'll see. Hoshi trying to keep pressure on. Tux, obviously, Tux doesn't play this game as much as obviously some of us do. But he understands, like, Tux is a grappler. So he likes grapplers. He likes, he likes touching Hoshi people. Hoshi closes this out really solidly with that grab. Recognizing the counter. And knowing that Machamp's counter takes a little bit longer to come out fully charged, he just went for it. Oh, she always goes for that. And so generally hold C. Okay. Shield really, or C I, I like that that calm mind into um, jump A. Uh, okay, so one of the things that I'll probably go over with Hoshi is learning that you can counter attack between the multi hit and the last hit. So I'll let him know. That so was that brave. He learns, but yeah. So Tux just goes all in. So Tux's game plan is typically just do it. He get, doesn't get care. In, grab. He doesn't care what your opponent is doing. He's just gonna go. Obviously here, you just see he just went for it, and, and again he just dead. goes for it. And obviously catching that counter attack was definitely gonna lead to a death there. So I feel like Hoshi's definitely gonna need to do a better job of trying to keep 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 Tux out in general. Like, watch for buff cross drops. Oh my god. Aww. He needs to keep an eye out for any kind of cross chop. Oh um, any any multi-hits from close combat. Like, there was good patience. 
I want to see a little bit more of that from Hoshi. Back All slap. Right. Not that sure. is a. Ooh, Hoshi dominating this round a little bit better. He's going to burst. He's got to burst. Boom blast soon. on wake up. Magically. Magically. Sorry. I, Magically. I can't, again. though. Let's see what he's going to do. Burst to keep himself a little bit safer. He's trying to avoid. Uh, I feel like he could have actually bursted there earlier. No, this is a bad idea. Yeah, but he's. Yeah. Oh, that's going to hurt. Tux. He's going to go for the counter. He's going to go for the grab. Oh. Kyle, that was a bad. That, Kyle, that was a bad call. <laughs> that was definitely a bad call. And Hoshi couldn't even hear you, and I'm sure he felt you saying 8x. Don't ever listen to me. All right, so we're bringing this game one to one. That was really smart on, on Tux because yeah. he was far away enough that even if the 8x happened, it was gonna win. Like he was gonna get that burst out no matter what. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> what's up, Wolf? Oh. How you doing, Shadow How Kiss? you doing? Welcome to the stream. Hi, Wolf. Utah's taking the mic from me. Fuck off. Hi, Wolf. <laughs> All right. I'm so. lucky he won't touch mine. <laughs> All right. Touch Tuck's mine and I will fucking job. eat Let's you. Let's see if Tux can uh, try and... Try and I feel like Hoshi's have a, having a really hard time when... As soon as Tux gets that in... That 8x is Hoshi's hilarious. Having a really hard time. And I think Tux just needs to recognize what he can do to try and get in. Because once he's in, he's in, and like Gardevoir doesn't have a lot that can really keep you away. That was a nice. That was smart, because I don't think Tux knows that uh, you can actually throw out an attack if you expect the grab, because I don't think he understands that if he just like, goes away. Like, if you just use a normal ungrab crushable thing, it won't. Ooh, not sure why he decided to drop shield there. Really good support. And that was the good. <laughs> wow. Oh, wait. Did Hoshi pick that up from us? I think so. That was a really solid, really solid thing to do. And I actually like his support choice here to push him back. Like, that's that's really solid for this matchup. Oh, I'm sorry. If you need to go to sleep, go to sleep. I'm not trying to keep you up. I feel like everyone should get proper amounts of sleep and enjoy life properly and not be like me where I wake I'm awake until 5 a.m. and then hate myself <laughs> yeah well, hey man video games Ooh, really good job with that uh, uh, magical leaf still got hit he manages to get past the uh, Litten oh uh, he can block and gets the counter attack off Counterattack Hoshi? Come on. Alright, so we're gonna have to go over that with Hoshi. He did punish, but we're definitely gonna have to go over that with Hoshi and let him know. Also let him know that you can uh, you can 2x and avoid the counterattack from Machamp. Cause it's it's a medium and doesn't hit low. Or just low can low sense? Okay. Uh, this is definitely smart from Hoshi to give him kind of some breathing room here. Oh, Tuck drop shield. I so, wonder if he was trying oh, to aim no. for. Oh no! There you go. You need to do that to keep him off. Yes. Oh, that's he went dead. to grab. That is super oh, dead. Oh, that's definitely dead. Here comes the waifu cannon. There we go. Hoshi like takes it. That puts him in the winners finals, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Wow. It's me and you, baby. Are we gonna have? To